Well, hello, everyone. Welcome to story time. Yes, hello. Welcome. Welcome, everyone. Tis I, King Snowbeard. And I'm Queen Skunk Hair. And. Yes. You're looking a little bit different today, dear. Oh, just a little bit. Because I'm wearing my hat. I haven't seen that hat in quite some time. No, it's true. It has been a while. You're looking just like you did when we first met, back when you were traveling with Buffalo Bill's Wild West show. That's right. Yes, I did that. That was a long time ago. Right, about, oh, you know, 1920 I think it was about 1920, yes. Yes. Um, anyway, that was your hat. It was my hat. I recognize it. Mm-hmm. And um, I have a hat. You do? I have my crown. Oh, well, I suppose that is a sort of hat, but it's not quite a hat. Are you wearing that hat because you've picked out a hat book for story time, perhaps? How did you guess? I'm the king. I'm a very smart. It's true. You're very smart. You know everything. Perhaps we should wake up our toes, as usual. And oh, then continue yes. our conversation about hats. Wake up toes, wake up toes, wake up toes, and wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wake up toes, wake up toes, wake and wiggle in the morning. Wake up feet, wake up feet, wake up feet, and wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. We don't wake have feet. feet, we pretend to have feet. feet. Wake and wiggle in the morning. Wake up legs, wake up legs. We wake don't have legs, legs. we're floating in the air. Wake up legs, wake up legs. Wake, wake up legs. If you have legs, wake them up. in the morning and you can clap your hands i can't but well, i can't I either can. Yeah. i can wiggle my head like this and you can show up your eyes Excellent dancers. Okay. I know that we're excellent dancers. So, back to the topic of hats. Right. You have a cowgirl hat there. I have a cowgirl hat. I have a royal king crown on my head. But you have a crown under your cowgirl hat. And I feel Mm -hmm. like I need to wear a special different hat if we're going to have a hat story. Right. So... Okay, I guess you better go find. find one. Let me go look. Oh, yes, yes. Oh, hurry, though. We, we don't have all day here. Well, what is that? I don't know. I found it in the kitchen. Is that a colander on your head? What's a colander? It's <laughs> <laughs> not a hat, silly. It's not a hat. <laughs> it's a colander it's a from colander. the kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to fool you. Oh, you're so funny. I was funny. trying to be funny. Oh, you're, you are. You're the funniest. Who ever would have thought to uh, put a colander on their head? I found oh, another hat. That's hilarious. I've been working on the railroad. 
I can't see. Who turned out the lights? No one turned out the lights. Who extinguished the candles then? No one. It's not even dark in here. What's the matter then? Well, you have a hat over your face because your hat is way too big. I do. Oh dear. Okay. <laughs> Okay, oh, I'll find something else. This seems very difficult for you. Uh, it's hard to find it. I'm just always, I always wear my crown, is all. Well, it's true. It's not like we have a ton of hats just lying around the castle. What is that? It's a can? Yes, and it's seems to say worms on it. It's a can of worms. So you've opened a can of worms. I have opened a can of worms. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 um. It is not a hat, though. It, it really isn't a hat. It fits over my crown nicely. It fits quite nicely, yes. And I see that there were actually some worms in there. Oh, my. Okay, hang on. Let me... Let's see if you can show the children. There are oh. worms. Oh, look, we can see your eyeballs and the worms. Oh, oh, like... oh, let me make it like that. Perfect. Yes, perfect. Well, yes. this is not actually a hat, but... But all of the worms are wearing hats. The worms are wearing hats! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh you perfect. so funny. Hat to wear for our hat story. That's right. So let me go get the book. Okay. And we will have a hat story. And this one is called, Which Hat Is That? <laughs> is it a, a can of worms? I don't think so, but it is by Anna Groose Nicole Hines. It's, this one is kind of a guessing game. Well, guess what kind of hat? When I wear a flippy floppy hat, a shady hat, a droopy hat. When I wear a flippy floppy hat, I dig, plant a seed, and weed, weed, weed. Which hat oh. is that? Oh, this book is very large. Oh, um, See, let me. There we go. Oh, oh! It's my gardening hat! It's a gardening hat! There are worms in gardens. There are, but not in garden hats. I beg to differ. Okay, okay, yes, I see. When I wear a tall white puffy hat, a spiffy hat, a spotless hat. When I wear a tall white puffy hat, I measure, stir, pour, and flip, flop, flip. Which hat is that? Um. I don't You have know. to move out of the way, dear. It's my, I, uh, my cooking the hat. They're the worms. Oh, yes, but there are no worms in cooking. <laughs> when I wear a shiny, bright red hat, a speedy hat, a hero hat. When I wear a shiny, bright red hat, I go, ew, ew, ew. Here, kitty kitty, which hat is that? It's my firefighter hat. I haven't gotten any of these right. I only know crowns and colanders and worm cans. Right. Well, you know, you know, cowgirl hats. Oh, he has cowgirl hats! <laughs> when I wear a fancy flowery hat, a frilly hat, a fussy hat. When I wear a fancy flowery hat, I tip, sip, smile. Don't mind if I do, dear. Which hat is that? A uh, crown. No, it's my tea party hat. 
Oh, I do love a spot of tea now and again. Of course we do! <laughs> the king and queen. That's right. That's mostly what we drink all the time is just tea. When I wear a far out spacey hat, a zippy hat, a twirly hat. When I wear a far out spacey hat, I zip, dash, zoom. I'm flying to the moon. Which hat is that? A, king, a crown king for the king. No, it's just my favorite hat. Look, it's like an, a space hat, an astronaut helmet, kind of. And that is the end of which hat is that? Yay! That was a wonderful story. Now, the book that I picked out does not have um, hats in it. It doesn't. I don't think it oh. has. Oh, I'm losing my hat. Hang on. Maybe there's no hats. What if my book is not as exciting because it's not about hats and I, and worms? Well, none of the books are about worms. I thought that everyone enjoyed the riddle guessing game book we did so very much that we it's would do. It's because we were so good at it, too. Well, we were. So I thought I'd read an, another book that lets us kind of. Um, Answer Have some them answer questions, right. sort of. Okay. You'll see. It's a bit hard to explain. Extra hard to explain while balancing a can of worms on your head. Whoa. Uh oh. Whoa. <gasps> oh no. Whoopsie. Uh, those, I'll see if they're all right. Those poor worms. And then I will get my book. Okay. I'm sure they're fine. Okay. Hmm. Would you rather by John Burningham? Would you rather your house were surrounded by water, snow, or jungle? We have castles in each of those places, so, so I don't know that we can answer that. We can't because we would. Just the, have it, all of them. Well, as I would be like, yes, yes, yes. Right. Okay, so that's the answer. Yes. It's yes. not yes. really a right yes answer. To, yes to all of them. Not really a right answer to these. They're more thoughtful questions. Mm -hmm. Deep thoughts. Would you rather an elephant drink your bath water? Wait, would you be in there with it? Hmm. I mean, in this picture, one must assume so. Ooh. An eagle stole your dinner. Right from your plate? Yes. A pig tried on your clothes. That seems really weird. Or a hippo slept in your bed. Hmm, well, hmm. 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 our hippos do have beds. So. That's true. Our hippo, the hippos but they don't have their sleep own. In our beds. No, the hippos have their own beds. Why would well, they these come? Are, these are all very. Very strange question. Our pigs have clothes, right. like custom clothes from the tailor. Yes. An eagle's mm. never stolen my dinner, but a falcon has. Right. Uh, I think this one just doesn't make any sense to me. Not at all. I guess an elephant drank your bath water. Because then well, they wouldn't need to water the elephants that day. Right. Or they could wash themselves with it because we're really mm, very... That seems very right. most efficient. Mm -hmm. That's... Let's, let's move along. Okay. Would you rather be covered in jam, um, soaked with water, or pulled through the mud by a dog? None of those. I mean, I've, I've never even been outside, so I would definitely not like to be covered in mud. Mm, yes. Mm hmm Soaked and with water. So that covered. looks like somebody. Jam is delicious, though. I guess I wouldn't mind that so much if I could lick it off my own arms. Oh, okay then. I'll go with that one. Sure, you can lick the jam off your own arms. You're the like king. I said, there's You're not the a king. Right... You can do whatever there's, you want. There's so that's not right. a right answer. No, 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 no. These are just deep thoughts. Would you rather have supper in a castle? Hmm. We already do that every night. Every day, yes. Yes, yes. Breakfast in a balloon. 
been there, done that. Right. Or tea on the river. Of course, we've done that that's too. Like every, that's like every afternoon every, yes. at tea time. Yes. I, but I don't understand the question. Right. These are impossible. These are pretty these much are, weekly, just, if not daily are, activities. Right, these are describing our lives. Huh. All right, moving on. Would you rather be made to eat spider stew, mm. taste slug dumplings, mm. chew mashed worms? Oh, oh, here are your worms, dear. But <gasps> chew mashed that, worms. That oh, must be why they oh, make cans oh, of them. Oh, oh. oh God! But now, now I'm very distressed. Now, very distressed. Um. Okay, let me read the last one. Drink a snail shake. It sounds disgusting. I'm still, I'm still upset about the worms. Can you read the next page? Because I just, I need a moment. Sure. Would you rather jump in the nettles for five dollars? Not really. Swallow a dead frog for twenty dollars. Ew. Or stay all night in a creepy house for fifty dollars. I mean, I think the last one because we do that right. pretty much every day. The That's right. There are parts of the castle that are very creepy. So, oh, what? Right. Well, how is that any different than the regular? This things book we is do? just very much like our normal lives. Mm -hmm. Okay, I think I can read again. Would you rather be crushed by a snake, swallowed by a fish, eaten by a crocodile, or sat on by a rhinoceros? Hmm. Who made up these pastimes? I don't know. Can you find I mean, out why? and fire them? Sure. Why would anyone want to do any of those things? Let me. I'll, I'll be. No. Back. It's terrible. Would you rather your dad did a dance at school, or your mom made a fuss in a cafe? Hmm. Mm. What do you think, dear? Well, I missed the question. I was going to see who made up these pastimes in this oh, book. Oh, yes, that's right. Would you rather your dad did a dance at school or your mom made a fuss in a cafe? Uh, well... My dad was a fabulous dancer. Mm -hmm. My mother also was a fabulous dancer, and uh, my dad was a fabulous dancer, but my mom never made a fuss in a cafe. I think I'm going to just say just with dancing, dad dancing. dancing. I'll always go with dancing. Would you rather clash two cymbals, bang a drum, or blow a trumpet? Why, all three. The royal trumpeters blow the trumpets. Right. Um... The royal drummer. Those seem fun though and noisy. Right. I could like all of those. Like we could be in a parade if we had Ooh. if we did those. Well, but then again, that's another but one we of our are weekly always activities. In a parade, so right. Would you rather tickle a monkey, hmm. read to a koala, box with a cat, skate Weird. with a dog, Weird. ride on a pig, mm -hmm. or dance with a goat? Well, I said dancing is always the answer. That's so dancing, the so, so dancing. dancing. Yes, indeed. I and agree. We are excellent dancers. Yes, teach us to be excellent dancers. It's part of our courtly manners. Would you rather be chased by a crab, Ooh. a bull? Ooh, people, people pay to do that. A lion, or mm. wolves? Well, since we have a pet lion, I think of the pet lion. Right. It's one of our pets. They're quite, they're quite friendly when when uh, they're a royal puppet pet lion. Or would you like to ride a bull into a supermarket? Oh, dear. Look at this. It's a huge mess. Let me... Look at this mess. Oh, Somebody will have to no. clean that up. Somebody must clean that up. Clean up. Immediately. Right. Would you rather be lost in the fog, at sea, in a desert, in a forest, or in a crowd. Hmm, we're so famous, I don't think we could ever be lost. Totally not, but we do right. like to take walks in the enchanted forest. It's true. I'm gonna go with that one. Would you rather help a fairy make magic, gnomes dig for treasure, an imp be naughty, a witch make stew, or Santa Claus deliver presents? Well, Santa Claus deliver presents because all of the presents will just come to my house or the castle. I mean, I was going to say, I believe that's the only one that I haven't already done. 
Oh. Yes, well, true. When you live in a fairy tale world, it's just that way. Would you rather live with a gerbil in a cage, a mm -hmm. fish in a bowl, mm -hmm. a parrot on a perch, a rabbit in a hutch, chickens in a coop, or a dog in a kennel? Well, if they're, you know, in the castle, it Hutch doesn't really, the doesn't really matter. The royal page turner messed up last time. Well, is it? That happens. Okay. You Obviously, say so, dear. it's very hard to get good help these days. Yes. Hmm. Hmm. We might need to start looking to uh, replace that royal page turner. Uh, I agree. Okay. We, we shall take this up later. Would you rather live with a gerbil in a cage, a fish in Wait. a bowl, a parrot on a perch, a rabbit in a hutch, chicken in a coop, or a dog in a kennel? I mean, if any of those are inside the castle, it doesn't really matter. They're all wonderful. Look at this. There's a person swimming in that fish bowl. I mean, he's in all of these, but like, doesn't that look nice and refreshing in the hot summer? He kind of does. I think I would choose that. If it were a giant fish bowl, that could right. hold me. Or perhaps you would rather just go to sleep in your own bed. Yes, of course. Like, our big, huge, humongous... I think that would be an excellent choice. Excellent choice, indeed. Well, dear. Yes? What do you suppose we should do next? I suppose we should shake our sillies out. Oh, that's right, yes. Um, that's how we wrap up a story time. Mm-hmm. You're, you're Do you think the worms would like to join in? Um, sure. I feel like they, they would. If they can be on, found can... anywhere. Of worms! I shall start with a worm. Are they still in your can? Start one of those worm composting things so that I can employ the worms so they don't have to be in this can. Well, it's true. They might like to have some better appointments than just Royal a can. composters! Right. We don't want someone to mistake them for, what was it, mashed worm? worm no! Mash? Not my worms! No! Not my pet worms! No, okay. these, these are very clean and friendly worms. <laughs> you can tell by their fancy hats. <laughs> Alright, we need to shake our sillies out. Let's do it. Gotta shake, shake, shake my sillies out, shake, shake, shake my sillies out, shake, shake, shake my sillies out, wiggle my waggles away. I gotta clap, clap, clap my crazies out, clap, clap, clap my crazies out, clap, clap, clap my crazies out, and wiggle my Look at the worms can't clap you. <laughs> oh. <laughs> they don't have hands or arms. Jump my jiggles out and wiggle my waggles away. I got a yawn, 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 my sleepies out. Yawn, 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 my sleepies out. Yawn, 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 my sleepies out. Yawn, 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 yawn,